welcome to another series of Reckless Eating Fair reviews. This time for the first time at the San Diego County Fair. I've never been to this one before. Uh, Val got us in. It was nice of them to have us. Thank you to the San Diego Fair people uh, for not charging us to get on in here. We got a media pass or something along those lines. But uh, what, uh, what are we doing? First. We are now at the Gansito booth stand, I guess. Uh, well, they have a fried Gansito and, and They're not at the side. For those who don't know what no. a Gansito is, this it, place is called, I don't know what it's called. It's called There's cotton. no name on it. This place is called Cotton Cake. This is one of the generic, like, you can get deep fried Reese's, you can get uh, Snickers, but they had game. And they'll be at every fair, yes. except in this particular case, they have thing. They had this, which you don't see at every fair. Yeah, they had the uh, Gansito, which is basically like a. Go for it. <laughs> All right, so hold on. Let me just explain this real quick for Biden. He'll cut this out. <laughs> Everything that could go wrong has gone wrong so far. <laughs> the the speaker wouldn't shut up for like three hours talking about mattresses, and then two old dudes just walked in between the shot because that's what you do when people are filming. But okay, we're back to it. This is Gancito, right? Is that how we yeah, pronounce it? Gancito. This is something that's sold out in Southern California all the time, uh, or at least out where I live. I know this is still like. But I have out, never but, seen this in any of the fairs. Yeah, it, I see it in Walmart like all the time. Uh, but it's a uh, deep fried whatever this is. We're gonna find out. And it's sitting in a bed of whipped cream. Yes. So I thought it was just on a stick, but apparently you, it's, uh, it's sitting on a bed of whipped You go for it first. Uh, if you want to check out the food reviews, uh, it's more going to be on my channel, even though you will see it on Val's, but Val's is going to be an overall arcing shot okay. of uh, the fair, so you can find out all that stuff. All right, you're going to have to feed me. Feed me the side. Feed me. Well, well it looks like there's some red stuff right. in there. You want that? Uh, oh, God. <laughs> I just covered the camera in that. Mm. Oh, it's so good. It's really sweet, mm. but the... Um, the whipped cream has a chemical taste to it. Yeah, a little artificial. chemical taste to it. So I, I, I kind of think it's Cool Whip or something like Cool Whip, more so than it's a little artificial. Whip cream. So that uh, Gansito though is like a cake. Oh my God, but that's so good. Yeah, it's like a cake. That's not that bad. There's chocolate in there. It's sweet, but it's not like crazy sweet. I don't know what that red stuff is because there's very little of it. It it's was like, uh, six dollars like or something. Or? It was six dollars and uh, fifty cents for this thing. Yeah, I would say it was worth it. I mean, I would rather have a deep fried Snickers or a Reese's, but hey, if this is your jam, and it might be. Yeah, it could work. Like a Twinkie flavor as far as the cake goes. Okay. Almost like a kind of Twinkie flavor, maybe a little not bit. sweet. Almost like a, a weird Twinkie. Like yeah. a Mexican Twinkie. Yeah, it's pretty good though. Uh, I'm gonna rate it, I'm gonna give it a four. It's all right, four out of five. I, yeah, it's above average. And I'm gonna give that a trippy food thumbs up. All right. So uh, the only thing that's off-putting is the, like I said, the chemical taste of the whipped cream, but you know, we're not eating that, so. No. Fine. All right. Wow, it's uh, it's horrible holding a camera up like this. <laughs> it is. is. A, what's that, whoa, the movie, you ever seen The uh, Punisher? With no. uh, Thomas Jane, no. at the end he kills John Travolta's son by putting a grenade in his hand and like tying it so that he has to hold it. And he's like, "You won't hold it for any longer than 23 seconds." It was like whatever. It was convoluted, but it was pretty cool. Maybe uh, the the Antichrist is gonna come down and cause the next coming. Cause like at this point, whatever could go wrong will go wrong, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, make I mean, sure to check out starting, so. Val's channel if you want to see like more of a general episode. As his is gonna be one continuous thing, uh, and we're just gonna do a bunch of reviews. Let's go. an important question to uh, ask everybody who watched. Did you like this episode? Are undecided on this episode? Or Tom Cruise?